Joanna man. Yes. Mm-hmm. I was not right for that too, is told. What? <laughs> I uh, didn't get the audition. Mm-hmm. Will Smith had been telling me for years. He, we, he took me to um, Miami to train for Muhammad Ali because I was training, right? So he told me for years, Miguel, listen to me. You got to start playing golf. That's where the big roles happen. Exactly, it's out on the golf course. When y'all reading for this little stuff, the big roles already giving away, da, da, da. So it was years out of the clear blue sky. I said, you know what? I'm going to go take a golf lesson, right? So I go to Witsit, and I'm taking golf lessons with the black guy who's like good. I mean, he, everybody uses him. So I'm there, he's teaching me this stuff like, that first time ever on a golf course, just, all right? And he's like, he goes, hello? He said, hey man, my name is Jesse Vaughn. Man, you're on Spark, dude, you're great. Listen, I'm directing a movie called Joanna Man, and we're having the um, 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 screen test at Warner Brothers. I will die if you would come and do it. And that's how I got the audition. Mm-hmm. <laughs> So, okay, so you know they had been, uh, which is yet another crazy classic. I know they hollered that at you walking down the street. But um, so then there was the whole um, issue of black men in dresses type thing. I heard that. What's your, what's your take on that as an actor and then just as a black man? Well, to me, it depends. Answer them both separately. All right, as, a, as an actor, well, to me, it's, it's the same. To me, I don't give a damn. To me, it's like, I don't, I don't if you're talking about an actor in a movie, funny movie like Joanna Man, Martin played a mama, da da da. I think that's the asinine, uh, uh, that's asinine to even equate that with anything. But I don't know about when you see dresses on the, um, on, and, and on the red carpets, that kind of thing. I would never wear any, any of that stuff unless it was just something so freaking double breasted fly with something. I don't well, know. Wait a minute now, because one is a character that's right. been written for you. And the other is a self-expression of their own self. Well, so that's what I'm saying. If you're gonna, you can't, if you're gonna say, you say that people talk about guys in dresses, how you gonna talk about guys in dresses and a character? Mm. You know what I'm saying? But I can understand you having that argument for guys in dresses on a thing where you could be saying, well, hold on, that's a da-da-da. I get, I get it there, but I don't get it in the movies. Um. So do you feel that there is a uh, low key plot to demasculate ma- de- de- brothers because you don't see them trying to put Tom Cruise in a dress, and I'm not talking about late Tom Cruise, the icon. <laughs> I'm talking risky business, I cr- Tom Cruise. Well, Tom Cruise on top right now because that, that. Well, movie, I know he's been on top. That he's movie just, just weird, passed the Titanic. That's fine. He's just a weird ass Scientology, but he's an acting beast, and you can't. Yes. Can't, can't read him for that. Time. But, uh, you know, they're not trying to put, like, Bon Jovi in a dress. They're trying to put, you know... But uh, here's the thing. They ain't putting these people you see in these dresses. These people are putting themselves in these dresses. Bon Jovi's just not doing it. And nobody's putting them in them dress. Everybody you see in one of them, they put them in there. Chappelle so it's the not them. Thing. Yeah, exactly. it is true. Ain't nobody put them in there. Hey, Sam, wear this. Oh, hey, somebody wear this. <laughs> you got the worst. Are you freaking kidding? You can. You got the right to well, say that. Well, you do have the right to say, yeah. I'm not doing that. Correct. Mm-hmm. Well, there you go. When, okay, so you was married, though, Miguel. What's up? I was married for 15 years to a lovely, incredible woman. Didn't work out. That's the bottom line. The bottom line is, on that is, um, we kind of grew apart. You know, I was on the road a lot. I was on the road a lot. I was doing plays. I did one play with Jakari Johnson. Were you being a little whore on the road? Absolutely not. Mm. Okay. Was I, she? No. We but we grew apart. You can't be away for six months and then do another one for six months, then another one for six well, months. Well, you can't be away from me for six months because I am in fact a philanderer. Ooh. So I can't I can't keep it together for six months without you, baby. Damn. Can we take a break? <laughs> <laughs> Let's go do it. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> no, okay. So, um, are you still in touch with her? Oh yes, we're really good really friends. Good She's friends. an amazing, good amazing, thing. wonderful friend. One, That's amazing, friend. wonderful mother. She's a, a beautiful person. She's a Christian, and uh, we're really good friends now. So. Black dynamite, brother. <laughs> I love that movie. Black dynamite, dynamite. <laughs> Were you in it? I did voiceover oh, for okay. it. Yeah. I did voiceover yeah. for it. And he's he's uh, he's uh, now one of the characters on on my show, Family Business, now too. I really yeah, love. Michael John. I love Michael John. You work. Hey, he's my, got a cowboy film coming out like that. My boy works with you on Family Business. Um, the Soul Train. Uh, my oh, brother. Ski. Oh my yes, God. He's I my mean, he's my favorite Louis character Carr. on the show. He's my favorite character. And I tell Ooh. everybody from there, dude. He is so. I never knew he was an actor like that. Okay. He okay. Right. Brilliant. Because we first only knew him as a soul, soul train dancer. dancer. But he stole the show then. He did. Then he started hanging out with you know New Edition. They latched onto him, so we see him in the videos and stuff. Yeah. I think that he always had acting 
uh, uh, aspirations yeah, absolutely. we didn't know. And then everything he got it and he murdered it. And this murdered right here, it. though. But this right here, dude, he's family business. He's gangster. Killed. I tell everybody, you got to see, dude, you won't believe it. He's, dude, we know him. Hold his eyes. Oh, he's good. He and is plus, I had a crush on him, and I got to kiss him one time at the Soul Train uh, tribute thing to Brandy and him having. It was amazing. He dipped me. Okay, <laughs> anyway, off the, uh, that was off the chart. Okay, so, um, all right. Now, school dance. Yes. I'm in that. I know. You killed it, too. School <laughs> damn, you killed it. And at the end Why of the Why do you think this... Okay, first of all, the fans know about school dance. It's an underground, you know, uh, one of those underground things. That's why uh, I'm the main queen of the underground, because I'm always in some underground shit. But school dance was star-studded once again. Yes. George Lopez. Yes. Yourself. Myself. Uh, Bobby G. And... Lil Duval and Kevin Hart and Mike Epps and Scruncho and uh, the Amber Rose back in the day and the new boy. I didn't. I wasn't in it. I just executive produced. Yeah. Yeah. But and you were it on was set awesome. When I was and she had, at the end of the movie, we was like, "How about we do? This? We gonna let her? You know how you have the, all the set ends?" And she start talking shit. So we just kept the camera going. She walked completely off the set. Camera still going. Walk past all of us looking at the, the, at the monitors. But and she, and she walked past us still shit talking shit. And she Brilliant. Yes. You made me do that. Yeah, I know. You made me do that. And they kept and it. They make me do these things. Yeah. So, like, just so um, why do you think that movie didn't get to... It was, that was supposed to really... That could have really... I, I, it could, why? What it happened still with can. Lionsgate? It still can. It can be it, a re-release. Well... I, I honestly don't know. You need I, to I, talk to your boy Nick. I that's don't really know what happened to him. I thought the movie would do a lot. All those you people still that, talk to That's me? why I say, no, I haven't talked to him in a long time. Because, you know, he, oh. but <laughs> it's so many stars in there that you just mentioned that I had forgotten about. That yeah. could def, it could be a hit now. It's all about timing, you know. I know. 